Well, good morning. It is finally Friday, so we made it to the end of the work week and today not looking too bad for a Friday the 13th. A little bit warmer and it looks pretty quiet. Live look on the south side of Lansing. It's still dark, but there are some clouds out there this morning. That's about all we're really going to see is mostly cloudy skies today with highs that climb close to 40 degrees. So temperatures this morning already starting out on the warmer side, mainly in the 30s. It's 35 degrees outside in Lansing, 33 the current temperature this morning in Marshall and Jackson. It's 34 degrees outside in Charlotte. Not much in the way of a wind chill, but some of us are seeing wind chills down in the upper 20s. But compared to the single digits like they have been the last couple of days, it's probably not feeling too bad. Now, high temperatures yesterday did manage to reach into about the mid 30s, right around average for this time of the year. Today, probably a few degrees warmer, reaching right around or just one or two degrees on either side of 40. So it is going to be warmer than average today and should be pretty pleasant if you need to get any last minute Christmas shopping or if you need to hang those decorations outside. Now satellite and radar across the area is just the clouds in place this morning. We will see at least a few peaks of some sunshine for today, but with the system passing by just to our north, not going to be seeing much in the way of sunshine this weekend, at least until Sunday. It's mostly cloudy today and tomorrow. So your future track as we go hour by hour, not too much going on. It's actually a pretty nice start to our weekend. There will be more clouds in place today, but at least it stays dry and it will be a little bit warmer. Again, we'll see at least a few peaks of some sunshine later on today. Now, as we go into the overnight hours and approach Saturday, it starts off and it should stay mainly dry. You'll notice the system passing by just to our southeast. It may be close enough that it'll clip at least a few areas. It may be enough to provide us with some isolated drizzle or some freezing drizzle Saturday afternoon into Saturday evening. The vast majority of us, though, actually looked like we stayed dry pretty much all the way through the weekend. That's the good news. Most of the bulk of that system passes by to our east and probably about 99% of us stay dry through the day tomorrow. Sunday also looks like it will be dry but colder with temperatures that fall back down below freezing. Today though, well above freezing. High of 41 degrees, mostly cloudy, slightly warmer than where we were yesterday. And tonight, we drop down to around 29 degrees, mostly cloudy, the chance for some patchy fog with light winds overnight. In your seven day forecast, tomorrow, there's a very slight chance for some isolated drizzle, but most of us stay dry with mostly cloudy skies and a high of 37. Maybe a little bit more in the way of sunshine, partly to mostly cloudy on Sunday and colder with a high near 30. Monday looks like we'll see some snow that could carry over and with some lake effect snow on Tuesday, and it looks much colder next week with highs either in the 20s or the low 30s. So, so make the most of this weekend. Yeah, that's what we're saying. If you need to hang decorations outside, yeah, it's probably better now. Get it next now. week. Yeah. yeah, don't put it off anymore. This yeah, is, exactly. This is when you need to do and, it. You know, we're down to you know, I think Getting eleven days till Christmas. So yeah. twelve, something like that. So it's it's time. It is. It's time to do you it. Need to get it. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Claire. You're welcome. Well, this morning the House.